Hello and welcome. This is Swati, and you're watching Peace News International. Now, starting with the headlines. Silver Jubilee of Gyan Sarovar, celebrated with great zeal. Senior BK members gathered from India and abroad. A newly built Brahma Kumari's Bulawayo Center got inaugurated. BK members from Zimbabwe witnessed the grand opening. And Mahashivratri was celebrated by Brahma Kumaris in different parts of the world. Spiritual significance of the festival was explained. Now the news in detail. Gyan Sarovar, meaning Lake of Knowledge, also known as the Academy for a Better World, is the Brahma Kumari's campus in Mount Abu, at the highest peak in the Aravali range of mountains in Rajasthan. The grand and gracious completion of 25 golden years of Gyan Sarovar in the spiritual service of humanity was celebrated with great fervor in the divine presence of all the senior members of the organization from the country and abroad. On the occasion of Silver Jubilee celebration, the President of the country, Ramnath Kovind, Vice President M. Venkaya Naidu, Prime Minister Narendra Modi and Lok Sabha Speaker Om Birla sent their heartfelt greetings. The Silver Jubilee was celebrated for three days through a series of events. The campus glittered with beautiful lighting. The celebration included cake cutting, candle lighting and sessions addressed by many prominent dignitaries. इस बैटरी से आगे अपने अपने सेंटर्स में जाकर जो ग्रहस्ती हैं हम जैसे जो लोग हैं जो विचलित हैं जो भूल चुके हैं अपनी ओरिजिनलिटी को उनकी बैटरी को जाके आप लोग फर्दर चार्ज करते हो टुडे वी आर वेरी आई एम इक्वली हैप्पी दैट आई एम पार्टिसिपेटिंग इन द सिल्वर जुबली सेलिब्रेशन ऑफ दिस ग्रेट ऑर्गेनाइजेशन व्हिच फादर हैड ये जो ईश्वरी विश्वविद्यालय के भाई बहन हैं, जिन्होंने उस पिता परमात्मा को अपने दिव्य नेत्र से देखा है पहचाना है उनके साथ संबंध जोड़ा है उनके साथ बातचीत की है और करते रहते हैं ये भाई बहनों के मन में एक ही बात है कि हम जल्दी से जल्दी इस संसार के अंदर जो कुरीतियां हैं जो पांच विकारों के कारण इतनी सारी दुनिया में दुख है अशांति है उसका निवारण जल्दी से जल्दी कैसे करें मुझे लगता है कि यहाँ से जो शांति के किरण विश्व में फैल रही हैं, अब जबकि हम सब यहाँ हैं, हम और ही ऐसे तपस्या करके वो साइलेंस पावर विश्व में फैलाए क्योंकि उनकी सिंप्लिसिटी तो है ही डिसिप्लिन भी लाइफ में बहुत है लेकिन वो दूसरे के ऊपर प्रेशर नहीं है नहीं कई बार आपके अंदर एक क्वालिटी है और दूसरे में कम है तो दूसरे को हमेशा प्रेशर सा लगता है कि आई कैन डो ये मैं तो ऐसा मान नहीं सकती है तो उसकी हिम्मत नहीं बढ़ती है लेकिन उनमें हमने ये देखा है कि उनकी अपना डिसिप्लिन अपना जो कुछ है वो हमारे ऊपर प्रेशर नहीं था क्योंकि मैं बहुत रिलैक्स पर्सन हूँ और मैं किसी तरह का भी दुख का तो मैं दुख से तो बहुत ही दूर रहती हूँ ना लेती हूँ ना देती हूँ B.K. Asha, director of ORC in Gurugram, and Raj Yoga teacher B.K. Shivani also share their deepest feelings. This is not an academy. This is not an academy for a better world. Because Gyan Sarovar's model is that this was a barren land. It was only a few rocks. 
यहाँ तक कि इसको नॉन एग्रीकल्चरल कि यहाँ कुछ उग नहीं सकता तो ज्ञान सरोवर की कंस्ट्रक्शन ही एक कलयुग टू सत्युग का ट्रांसफॉर्मेशन है कि एक बैरन लैंड एक ऐसा स्थान बन गया जिसको सरकार ने भी इनाम दिया इसको पैराडाइज की पदवी दी Now moving on towards Zimbabwe an inauguration ceremony of the newly built Brahma Kumaris Bulawayo Center took place The grand opening was witnessed by all BK members from Harare Kwekwe and Bulawayo The event opened with introductions and the history of the Bulawayo Center which was followed by a candle lighting and cake cutting Later on, BK Dipti, center coordinator of the Brahma Kumaris in Nairobi, Kenya, introduced the initial construction team. Deputy Minister of Industry and Commerce Raj Modi and Tak Varsha, a representative from the Ministry of Sports, Arts and Culture, gave a speech emphasizing positive thoughts. The healthy mind, it's a healthy body. So for us to live peacefully it's very important we have a healthy mind and that only we can achieve with meditation and some of the courses which been offered by Brahma Kumaris Brahma Kumaris is a non religion organization non profitable organization they believe in mankind service the mankind and they invite every walks of life to come and join I'm here to pledge that we are going to continue working with Brahma Kumaris for the benefit for the benefit of our youth in our communities um i say god bless you and god bless this institution i thank you bk dipti then shared her experience and also took the whole crowd through the amazing glimpse of meditation the program concluded with a vote of thanks and appreciation certificates were handed out to all involved in the construction gifts blessings and toli were then distributed to everyone present now the news from united states bk sabita attended an interfaith service for climate change organized by two chi foundation and gave a meditation commentary on love and respect for the five elements many prominent interfaith leaders were present including chair of the committee for religious ngos the committee for religious ngos organized a special event to honor interfaith harmony and gender equality where faith leaders were asked to light a candle and tie a ribbon to illustrate solidarity during this event BK Nani met with the president of Peru Martin Vizcarra The Brahma Kumaris in Jamaica celebrated the festival of Shivratri in Kingston Montego Bay and Oco Rios in Jamaica Beautiful programs were organized in all three places in the country The celebrations included talks on the spiritual significance of the festival and how to truly celebrate it followed by cake cutting ceremonies and peaceful minutes of self-realization. BK sisters shared their valuable wisdom with the gathering, and everyone experienced being spiritually alive again. The whole gathering celebrated Shivratri as the spiritual birthday of spiritual beings, with the spiritual source of energy entering each one's life. Peace Day was celebrated at the Brahma Kumari Center in Los Angeles in a meditative atmosphere. The event started with a guided meditation by BK Christina which was followed by the meditation session by BK Vivek after meditating together for a few minutes BK Geeta director of the Brahma Kumaris Los Angeles Center shared few experiences from her spiritual journey and guided everyone into a peaceful conversation with the self Now moving on towards Canada the BK members in Vancouver came together to celebrate Trimurti Shiv Jayanti at the Surrey Center. BK Dr. Claudia, center coordinator of Vancouver, addressed the audience on the topic God, the one source. Children then performed a play and BK Claudia took the audience through a guided meditation commentary and everyone felt deep inner silence. The hearts were filled up with pure love for God. and everyone experienced spiritual enlightenment 
That's all for now. Thanks for watching Peace News International and have a great day ahead.